I met Alex in the library at Tarleton State University when I was um, actually showed up with the group of friends and he was studying at a table all alone and the friends I was with I didn't know it but they knew him and, and I don't know why but I turned around and I saw this beautiful girl Yes, that's you, MJ. And we sat down, and I kept talking, and Alex was trying to study for a test. And she is just loud, talking, talking, talking. And I've got about 30 minutes to finish my homework. This has got to happen. I've got to read a whole Spanish story, answer questions, the whole nine. So I tell her very, very kindly, Mary Jane, or girl, hey, you're being very loud. This is the library. People do not talk in the library. Do you please mind being quiet? I just kind of looked at him and I said, okay, and then turned around and started talking again. <laughs> that is how we met. That is it. I think he was flirting with me. He wasn't angry, but he was kind of saying, be quiet, but then laughing about it. Because he really was trying to study. Hard work pays off. School work pays off. That is serious. With a, just a little slight, slight, slight twist of flirt. <laughs> a couple of days later, he figured out I was working at Town & Country Bank whenever he was depositing his money. And from that point on, he kept coming every like three days. And he would ask me out and ask if I wanted to go to dinner. And I kept telling him, no, no, no. Because I, you know, I don't know why, but I kept saying no. And then out of nowhere, we started talking on Facebook. And um, I don't know, he got my number through there, I guess. Well, after I got denied about 15 times after going to the bank and asking her out, first day was at my house on Fry Street. We're going to grill out. She finally said yes. Thank the Lord. And uh, I cooked some burgers. I cooked some, or we, we cooked some burgers, some shrimp poppers, and some dogs. And my watch got so hot cooking over that grill that it started burning. And I was like, man, I'm done for. She's not going to, she's not going to dig me. We, we just clicked. It was just, it just worked out. I wasn't even looking for anybody and I think God just put it in my life. And it just worked out. I came back from New York and I got back and we we're so happy to see each other. We just smooched right there and I don't know, I, that was it. Honestly, I figured that out maybe a month or two into the relationship. Just the way he was, the way he acted and just the caring and loving kind of personality he had. I knew that's what I wanted for the rest of my life. Okay, I proposed um, March 16th, 2013. I had just spent the week with her in Abilene. Uh, I was on spring break, my first year teaching. He proposed to me um, a year ago from this day, um, and it was in front of Tarleton State University where we met. Um, we went to eat at Hard Eight Barbecue because whenever we met, that's where he was working at. I took her to Hard Eight Barbecue. Um, in Stephenville. Mario was coordinated to be hiding in the bushes to snap pictures and we went to walk around Tarleton State University because um, that's where I first met her at the library. Unfortunately it was closed so we couldn't go in so I took her up to the front steps of uh, Dick Smith Library and it was cold one night and he got down on his um, knee and asked me if I'd marry him and I said yes of course. And we talked and I, I just told her what I had on my heart and and uh, I just dropped to one knee and just asked her. I just asked her, just, will you marry me? And first thing she said wasn't yes, it wasn't no. It was, have you asked my dad? Have you asked my dad? And I told her no. And she was like, ah! And I told her, okay, I'm just kidding. And she said, yes, of course I'll marry you. After I told her that I had. throughout this whole life that we get to spend together. Love, fun, and play, and a lot of prayer. 
you know, what I expect is to have a happy, long marriage with one another and just to have God in the middle of it because that's the only way we're going to get through it. Praise God for everything. That's it. I am, yes, very excited.